Hello everybody, this is Sirik1983 and welcome back to Final Fantasy X. Okay, so as I mentioned at the end of the last episode, there is one more thing we can get here in Luca, and it is actually in the Poseid Aurochs dressing room. Hey, the Aurochs are still here. Hey, what's up guys? Uh, <laughs> I thought he said, I hope she dies. <laughs> oh man, there's something for you. And the fire plane kind of looked like you, yeah? I don't know, I didn't really see a resemblance, but eh, maybe they use the same facial model or the, you know, same 3D model, just different hair, that kind of stuff. Oh, what about these guys? There's a couple. Yeah, I guess not. Okay, just the one thing. What about you, Letty? Luzu and Gato are doing. No one from Poseidon's heard from either. Oh. Well, we know how both of them are doing. Getting married. I guess so. Alright, so you look in the second last locker room here and you get the Jupiter Crest. This is one of uh, Waka's items that he needs in order to get his Celestial Weapon. And thank you to, uh, I can't remember your name, It's a, I think I remember it was a pretty long one, but uh, <laughs> um, apparently it's not 250 games of Blitzball and 450 games of Blitzball. Apparently it's only 250 battles, like, as in fiend battles, like while you're go going through the game, and 450 battles. So I might actually be able to get the Jupiter, the, uh, Jupiter Sigil for Waka's um, ultimate weapon. So uh, who knows, maybe I will end up doing that, but I, it won't be for quite some time when uh, I'll be able to actually you know, start procuring all the items needed to be able to, to uh, forge them. So, all right. As promised last episode, it gets quicker from here on out in terms of uh, at least getting to Besaid anyway, so let's go up here. The next one is actually in Besaid Village, so let's get on the ship to Kilika. Oop, wrong dock. <laughs> yeah, I wonder who's playing the uh, Blitzball screen there. All right. So yeah, I should be able to get the this uh, Sphere Hunter uh, series done this uh, this episode. Board, yes. I hope we don't have to fight Sin again. Yeah, you can go around talking to people if you want. Uh, yeah, let's do do some of that just to break up the monotony of you know travel sphere, travel sphere. Uh, before Operation Mayhem, only a few returned from the front. There's a scene. Yes, they have. <laughs> the Rx1. What kind of cheap tricks did they use? <laughs> uh, come on, crush them next year. Yeah, maybe. They have yet to win a game against us, but. Well, so, hey, what about you? Uh, sleep and rest. We'll get there by the time you wake up. Uh, cool. cool. Right, so yeah, just you just have to go downstairs and rest, and uh, everything will be all right. <laughs> yeah, talking to his dog, I guess makes sense. I'll take a, uh, work on the wino just because it pays well. Uh, I guess he's sick or something. Uh, all night long. Please let me get some sleep. Oh, okay. Why don't you go downstairs, downstairs, guy? All right. What about up here? Here. Oh, there you go. That was a Spira. Yeah. Right around here are lesser Spira goals. Alrighty. No more up here. Anything back here? Oh, she is. This is literally. Uh... Oh, this must have like a kid brother or something like that. I can't really see it that well. <laughs> Alright, let's go downstairs. Yep. And we're back at Kilika. And in order to get to Besaid, well, get back on the ship. Besaid Island.
Now, this is the SS Leaky, but I wonder... Hey, sweet! I got this one a whole, uh, sp sphere early. So, alright, let's watch this one. Check sphere. Yeah, take a look. After you get that Aeon from Besaid, where are we going? Back the way we came. Then we go north from Bavel and climb Mount Gagazet. Beyond it lies Sanarkand. Sanarkand, huh? It's been in ruins for a thousand years, right? So the legends say. No one knows for sure. It still could be your Sanarkand. Thanks for trying, Orin. I thought if I went with you guys, I might find a way to go back. But it's not that easy. I'm sorry. No need to apologize, Braska. It's not your fault. I should be thinking about fighting Sin now anyway. Xanarkin can wait. But I will find my way back. Be careful, Jekt. Hey, I'll be alright. You're the one that should be careful. Wouldn't want your little girl to cry. She'll be all right. She's strong, like her mother was. Oh, sounds like they got pretty close to each other. Uh, we're much on board to guard the ship. I come to decline the offer. We can take care of ourselves. Oh, okay. <laughs> She'll still sail after the stomping sin gave her. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> there's a little monkey there. I think they have a role in the games at some point. I'm not sure though. I can't remember. Yeah, let's see if there's any on, anybody on here we know. I wonder if lo losers on this ship or not. Uh, I wonder if they're related. Who? Well, that's that's any related. Uh, she's talking about these guys. Change it. Anybody Yevin doesn't cost a single game, even when I take my dogs on board with me. Oh, there you go. So my partner has turned into a gutless wonder. He used to be so dependable, but now he just stares into the sea with terror in his eyes. Well, gee. <laughs> hey, what's this? Oh, looks like a little doll. And again, like the other ship, you just go downstairs if you want to uh, rest. Must be his pet monkey. <laughs> oh man, that sounded dirty. All right, you're in the ship, and the sin attack just right. Yeah, <laughs> it's uh, you know, I mean, sin keeps following us wherever we go. I mean, it, it's got to be just a coincidence. Try and teach me how to become merchants, but they all, all they do is play. <laughs> yeah, let them alone. All right, let's go. Yep. And we're back at Besaid. Yay! Home sweet home. Uh. Alright, so... Let's talk to him. Yeah, when are they gonna come? I guess when they, they're no longer champions, I guess. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, I guess that must have been Isaru. Oh uh, yeah, Sarun Pase and Maruda passed this way. Oh cool. So yeah, basically all these spills, spe <laughs> spheres are doing is basically we're actually walking the steps that Yuna's father took on on his pilgrimage. So yeah, I thought that was kind of relevant to uh, you know backtracking like this, even though it's boring as hell, especially the first little bit there. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna head back to the Besaid village. Uh, it's basically the same way you took uh, to. Oh, it's, I'll show you anyway, cause yeah, it's not. It's not the same way as when we got there the first time, although you know, I'm sure you'd probably be able to get there yourself, but uh, just to refresh anybody's memory, yeah, you gotta go up here. So yeah, I'll head back to uh, Besaid, and uh, I'll meet you there. 
And there we go. So we're looking for the last sphere. Let's talk to some people here. <laughs> She's still going on about that. Uh, the one after 23, you're, lo you're losing streak. Uh, that'd be the day. <laughs> we're winning. <laughs> I guess they haven't been back, but yeah, they did win because you know I won for them. All right. Uh, yeah, let's see if loser's back. What the? Where is he? He isn't back yet. Oh, I hope nothing happened to him. Oh, we're defeated. Terrible news because I turned the yeah, TV. Maybe. Sounds like it. Eh, maybe. I mean, for Luzu anyway, but, uh... I don't know who's gonna break the bad news about Gata. But, anyways, the fu the... Well, I guess the ninth out of ten spheres that you can find in the game is right over here. On the ground, you barely see it there, but there we go. Jack Sphere. Take a look. Smallest heap of huts I ever seen. Now, that looks like a fine place to live. Hmm. Oren. My lord. When this is over, could you bring Yuna here? I want her to lead a life far away from this conflict. You have my word. I will bring her here. Thank you, Oren. You're a good friend. What are you guys doing? Let's go! So hungry I could eat a shoe puff whole. <laughs> Sorry. Well, let's go then. I wonder if any of those kids were actually Walker or Chapu or anything like that, because you know, that was ten years ago, so really, I mean Walker I think he's I think the uh, game guide says he's like 25 now so he'd be 15 back then so yeah so that's nine out of the ten spheres the tenth one well we'll be getting that uh, later on in the game but yeah so that's basically all the backtracking does um, and I guess yeah, that's about all the time I have for this episode so in the next episode well I'll off screen I'll head up to uh, well the uh, Makalania uh, forest again. Remember to I'll remember to use the uh, the shortcut, you know, the glittering path at the beginning to the end. And then I'll meet you at the save sphere outside of where we fought the Sphere Morph. All right. So this is Cyric 1983. Thank you for watching and have a good one.